I'm Joe Anselmo, Editorial Director for Aviation Week Network, and I'm here at the Informa Farm Progress Show in Boone, Iowa. And with me is Taylor Moreland. Taylor, you're the owner of AgriSpray Drones. Welcome. Thank you. So it's nice to check out some drones. I usually go to air shows, uh, didn't expect to see us at a farm show. Uh, tell us about your business and, and what your drones do. Sure. So essentially, we sell these units to farmers and to air applicators uh, across all industries, primarily focused here in the Midwest uh, on row crops. Um, we're the largest distributor of sprayer drones in the U.S. currently, and um, we're excited about this new technology. When people think of spraying, they think of crop dusters. You're not out to replace crop dusters, right? You're there here to complement them. That's correct. You know, really. What, what I guess I guess the question is what areas do these drones work the best in and where we've seen the highest use has been in areas where crop dusters haven't been prevalent you know so we're in Missouri you know just south of us is areas where lots of small fields 10 20 acre fields crop dusters can't get into those areas but drones can so those areas are going from having no crop duster to having local service providers with a drone which is awesome to see and then you know other areas where maybe they have some big fields some small fields we see crop duster companies actually utilizing drones to cover those small fields because it saves them money because they don't have to take a machine out there and kill their efficiency in those small fields so what does one of these drones cost you uh, you're looking at about a full setup, uh, about 35000 Of course, you need a truck and a trailer and a tank and a pump and stuff like that. But as far as drone equipment itself and training and licensing, about 35000 And they're all different sizes. We have a few smaller ones we're looking at and then obviously the, the bigger one. What's the difference? So the biggest one here behind us, uh, this is the T-30. This is currently the biggest one approved here in the U.S. There is a T-40 coming uh, very soon to the U.S. market, waiting on uh, FAA approval for that. We also have a T-10, so that is all liters. So T-10, 10 liters, uh, T-30, 30 liters, T-40, 40 liters. That would be 2.5, 8, and 10.5 gallon. Okay, and where are these drones made? They're all made in China right now. Um, so China is the number one manufacturer of drones in general. And sprayer drones, uh, really, they started there because... You know, you look at a Chinese, you know, farm, family farm, and it's much smaller than, you know, U.S. typically. And so they went from backpack sprayers to drones, which made their efficiency so much greater. And so that boosted the economy and the in, in industry of sprayer drones there. Now they're exporting. Okay, well, you got a lot of people here waiting to talk to you. Thank you for taking the time to uh, share all this with us. Thank you.